welcome to Don't Be Dirty. <laughs> show that shows you don't have to be dirty. With us is Tony, three-time semi-finalist, and John, keen to be clean, who came through unexpectedly when last week's finalist, Mr Nottingham, died in a canoe. <laughs> Tony, I'd like you to start first. Would you describe for us, Tony, please, the act of fellatio, that's the act, Tony, of fellatio without Tony, and I'm sure you must know the rules by now, without being dirty. And the time starts five seconds ago. Uh, <clears throat> this uh, is an act that takes place between two people, uh, possibly of opposite sexes, but possibly not. <laughs> Careful, Tony. Uh, whereby <laughs> one of the participants <laughs> takes a part of the other participant's person into the place where they might more commonly keep bubble gum, say, <laughs> and uh, proceeds to masticate. Oh, uh, Tony, I thought you were a goner there. <laughs> <laughs> uh, until the other participant arrives at a state of uh, pleasurable relaxation, uh, the second participant then gives the first participant ten quid and goes home. <laughs> Can no one beat this big man from Hunstanton. Well, John, it's up to you. Now, your topic is the preservation of hardwoods. <laughs> the time starts. Then. Well, this is a very necessary business operation. Uh, Tony's challenged. Uh, he said business. <gasps> you did say business, John, you did. A little bit dirty there. Minute away, but plenty of time to go. Operation that has to be carried out if developers are not to raise our hardwood forest. Another challenge from our reigning champion. The nature of your challenge, Tony, please. He said, he said raise. He did say raise, Tony. Raise is an anagram of arse. Raise is an anagram of arse, Tony. Tissy, tissy, tiss. So sorry, I'm afraid we have to lose you. You were keen to be clean, but you came up against a man very much at the top of his form.